what would happen if you could bring the interactivity of the internet to the broadcast experience of television. For a long time we've looked at the internet as being separate from the television experience. But we know that a day is going to come when the internet is going to collide with the TV. NextGen takes CNN television and puts it in the hands of the consumer. CNN has such scale and we have such depth. I think what was important for us was if we were going to get into this interactive TV, what would it look like? NextGen puts consumers in complete control of the news. It allows them access into our control rooms. We may be just a tad early to your razor. We're giving them a glimpse into what's coming up in the show. We're giving them a glimpse back into what happened. Any segment from any show in the past 24 hours. If you could put the control in the consumer's hands of being able to scroll through that rundown, you would create a whole new way of watching television. We're also giving you extended or related content about what you're watching as you're watching it. One thing we definitely do know is that people want context. People want a layer of information, and that's what the internet does. Right? TV is linear. It's just a signal that's going out. But the internet provides layer after layer. You can have as much or as little as you want. So if you're watching a story, we'll give you background. We'll give you a photo gallery of the key players. We'll tell you how you got here, all in one screen experience. By creating a product that allows the anchor in the studio to be talking about a particular subject, but then bring all of that information in contextually below it and allow somebody to click through, scroll through, and find that information and look at it all in the same experience would be something that would be transformative.